All right, we're gonna do something kind of fun. We're gonna run some big block modifieds. Um, quickly before the race starts, this is the paint scheme we're rolling with, just black on this side. Uh, this is what it looks like on this side so far. Um, I started making this yesterday, or two days ago actually. Uh, it's got the name on it, which is kind of nice. I have to move that a little bit. But yeah, this is what it looks like. Cool, epic. Good luck, everybody. Good, I didn't teach you things five laps. So, you know, yeah, this will be, this will be fun. Um, 65 laps here at Cedar Lake, like the guy said. Um, it's a very long race here at Cedar Lake. Um, we're starting on the back row, literally the last car on the back row, which is nice. So, it's gonna be fun. Um, just gonna pretty much go see where I can end up. Um, this is like my second ever race in big blocks. I don't usually race these cars. I want to start because these cars are really cool. Um, but it just, with everything else, it does get difficult. Um, yeah. In the open practice session, before the race session, I was like, I don't even remember, I think I was like fifth. Overall, I put in a really good lap, 14-0. Um, having trouble replicating it. Uh, but yeah, starting at the back because I don't feel confident enough in this car to qualify and start up front. So, yeah, we'll see. 65 laps here at Cedar Lake is <clears throat> definitely a long race. Also, not running the rock screen. <clears throat> that is just down to the fact that it... Excuse me. Um... The rock screen, unlike in the sprint car and the midget, it, it's a bunch, and it doesn't look as good. Um, it literally is an eyesore, so, yeah. But here we go, 65 laps here, Cedar Lake, um, big block modifieds. Try not to suck, showtime. Right on the brakes early, just get the car rotated pretty much. Bottom is not the line I want to be on right now, or at least it feels like it. To clear up, I will. I like the top because depending on how comfortable you are, you can run it pretty deep. Jump into the bottom here because the 14 car was there. Turn freight train past the 13 here. Uh, in terms of setup, uh, not custom. Josh Wolf of Major Series. Uh, Josh, of course, is one of my team bosses. Is my team boss for Grizzly Motorsports. So I trust him wholeheartedly with setups. Um, he also has been doing this since his cars come out. Um, and he's won countless races with his setups, so I trust him a bunch. So yeah, that's where we're going to set up free on the Major's Garage website. Um, I'll put a link if I remember down in the description. Look, took 14 car, got a little wall, he fell back. Adoring each other up there. I'll get a car around that probably brings a caution. I'm not gonna reckon. Maybe not. Doesn't look like it, so it's an extra position. One thing about these races is going a lap down is deadly. Great time. car. Um, like I said, this is like the second every time running these cars in a race, so, you know, 
just kind of feeling the water right now. Guy behind me is throwing it in deep to get position, try to get the position. Ooh, blinking is not gonna help that. Oh, we're gonna go sideways to distract it. Oh, I did not mean to run into the wall if I did. Hey, Nine, I'm sorry if I ran you into the wall there. Uh, we didn't really on the bottom. I'm gonna try to jump this middle line. No, I'm not. I'm gonna be I'm gonna triple the cushion. I'm gonna blink, which is gonna be worse. Gotta really be careful to turn one, so the car gets really bouncy because of the bump that's there. Which I learned today at Dodge County Fairgrounds. Uh, we were there for an MSA race. Unfortunately, that got rained out. Hence why I'm racing this. Uh, that bump is actually there in real life. I asked Tyler because he ran Cedar Lake real life a few weeks ago. And he said, yep, it's there in real life. And it is as bumpy as it seems. Bridge. I'm terrible right now. And we're about to get left, which isn't going to help. So I'm going to get the wall. Because <sighs> you're going to run me all the way up in the wall. Car's broken as well. That's great. Don't you just freaking love lap cars? Leaders think they're entitled to the entire track, so they run you all the way up in the goddamn wall. Now we're just praying on a caution, pretty much. Actually, no, not even because it's gonna screw me over even more. The only thing a caution is good for is getting me into the pits. Also, I think it wouldn't help me. It's like if I can jump into the pits during a caution. Yes. That is actually exactly what I wanted. Heck yeah. Because he was sitting there. Whoa. Alright guys, figure it out. Can we figure it out, please? Oh, great, I'm getting sent all the way to the back. Blows is there's no pit 
time. So I don't get two minutes in pit area. The frickin' manager... Can't wait. It's a whoop section at the bottom of turn one. Mandatory repairs are stupid. You're not clear. Do you want to come down the track? You're when you're not clear. Feel free. To come off the track. I know I kind of steered off the wall, but like I'm avoiding the wall. Don't slide up when you're not clear. 13's in the wall. Should have enough fuel. guy's digging on the bottom, he's gonna murder me, I'm calling it now. Cause he's going for a gap that is not there. I'm just gonna stay playing to the bottom. If he turns me, he turns me. At this rate, there's really nothing I can do, so... I think this series goes to the... the shop next week. Or no, Lima next week. Which I'm excited for, because these cars have short track, so they're not excited to really excited for them. Hey, we're halfway. Which is hard to believe, might I add. Gets hard into the wall. I don't see why I was moved to the back. Car sitting at the exit of pit lane again. And it's not even worth pitting because it's gonna be like eight minutes of repairs, and I don't have eight minutes. Claude, Jason, that was fun. Yeah, that was some good racing, guys. I tried my best to stay off his back bumper and not screw up in front of you. I didn't want to take anyone out. That, that was some pretty good close racing. Yeah, it was fun. Yeah, the whole race, like, three through six have definitely been under a blanket. Well... So far we're sitting well, in a zero. Well, you got a good run going, pal. Keep it going. Definitely lose the same. Yeah, there's some there's, there's a big crash. 
kind of hope there is. But I doubt it. Hey, there's a big crash. It's better as we stay green. Oh, we got cars fighting flashing left and right. That's great. Carp into the wall. He stopped the ship from pull a caution. Yep. It's a chicken crap move. This park up there. Unless he's telling. Are you fucking kidding me? Thank die racing with your stupid fucking glitching. Uh huh. I apologize for his language, by the way. Should have wanted to go 19 at the line. What a fucking joker. I think he actually should be positioned as well, which is kind of funny. Also, the nine car is pit, which is good for me. It's position. I think we're going to be inside. Restart. Yes. So we should have a car to our outside. Definitely a decent position. Especially two position cars, one of the pits. Oh, no, never mind. What I need right now is a big crash which we need to avoid it pretty much. I feel like the top three to be fighting and hate each other. Sorry, we you back in the Kill each other like that. What was that? Come on. Exactly like that. Sorry about that, five. I tried sticking up, my guy. That's the way. Uh huh, uh huh. I like it. What would you call it? Well, five. That was fun there for a little bit. Well, nice cranks. I think the guy who's positioned in front of me is going to stay out. Maybe not. Nope, he's not. There's two guys in the pit, so that should be 10th. Like three more people to crash. If I have any dreams. Where's the seven? Right here, just told me to pass you, but. I just know I'm up top starting beyond six. But I'm sorry. Whoever was complaining there about what the hell was that. When cars hit the brakes in front of me, I check up. I know where to go. Here we go. Back to goal. Then, 
thing while they're hitting the wall. Brakes. As we keep straight, amazingly. That's four wide right there. They are racing, but there's no tomorrow. I'm diamond in the corner because I'm a dipship. Ooh, they're in the wall. That guy's in the wall. I think he got sucked in. Oh, no, another I racing glitch. Oh, no, it's not an I racing glitch. He's alive still. Dang it. Across the line to beat him battered eighth place. Various guys can win, Jason. Beaten, bruised, and battered eighth place, but that's still an okay spot on Smith. Definitely hacked. Say that as much.
I hit and I climb it. But that nine's getting into me either way, so. It sucks, but that's just what it is. It's a nice long race. Hey, we gained a single I, I rating. Yes. Top split. Ryan Conrad. Don't even recognize any of the names. I'm a bomb split. No, nobody. But I am actually really happy with gaining 1-1. 1 -1. 16 1. It's a good run. Definitely helps. Nine lead changes as well, which is kind of cool. Apparently, I led four laps. Heck yeah. That's cool. That was a nice race. Well, if you enjoyed that race, you want to see stuff like it, make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe. I try to get weekly videos out like this. Uh, hopefully, you guys enjoyed the, this video. Um, Definitely new series, so definitely excited with it. Um, if you have anything you want to say, leave it down in the comments below. I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible. Um, can't make any promises, but I will try. And other than that, um, hope you have good luck in your next race. Um, and I hope you guys join me for my next one. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.